What is going on everybody? Welcome back to Phones and Drones. Okay, for any of you guys that picked up the new Pixel 8 or Pixel 8 Pro, Google introduced a new software feature in here called AI Wallpaper. They talked about this briefly and it is actually a pretty neat new feature built into Android 14. So this background wallpaper that you see right here is actually one of those AI generated ones. I do want to show you guys a little bit about this. So it's very easy to find. We're going to hold down on the screen, go to wallpapers and styles, and when you go to more wallpapers down here, it is now the first option up top, as you can see, that says AI wallpaper. So this isn't every possible option or scenario you might think of. There are some preset features and keywords to generate this wallpaper. So you have a couple of design ones, specific looks you might be looking for. Um, if you want something translucent, are you looking for terrain, um, x-ray, night? Let's just pick bloom to start. Whenever you select one, you will see these keywords underlined here. For instance, a hazy image of lavender plants on a backdrop of, again, red space galaxy. So you can tap on these keywords here. Lavender plant can be changed with jasmine flowers, tulips, daisies, carnations, plants, daffodils, cherry blossoms, forget-me-nots, sunflowers, or one other thing I don't even know. So we're going to say sunflowers on a backdrop of, let's do turquoise. And instead of Space Galaxy, let's change that to, let's do Mountains. And then once you select all of these options, all you're going to do is hit Create Wallpaper. And it does take a moment, and you will get a few options once this finishes generating. So, this is your first image. That is your second option. Third option. And fourth. These are definitely probably not some of the better ones I've seen here. I don't think the first one is that bad. That's actually pretty decent. But if you want to change that, let's do something more common that I think a lot of people will like, and that is actually terrain. So here's the terrain option. You have surreal or realistic. Let's use surreal, and instead of cliffs, let's make it beach in shades of, mix it up here. Let's do silver. And again, all you will do is hit Create Wallpaper, and it will, again, generate a new AI image. Some of these that I've seen have been really, really neat, actually, and then others, like you saw there, not the best. So Surreal Beach in Shades of Silver, you can see exactly what it generated here. Now, if you want to change anything, instead of just saying silver, let's do blue. It's as simple as regenerating like that, changing your options on these specific pre-built ones. After this one, we'll jump through another one. That's actually a pretty good one right there. I do like that one. That's pretty good. It looks like some of Google's old images as well. Um, let's do painting. So, for painting, it says a painting of a mountain, or you can do any of these other options here. We'll do tropical island, and spaceships will change to unicorns. In the 19th century realist, let's do, hmm, let's do abstract style. So again, just hit create, and we'll see what the AI will come up with for this painting look. A painting of a tropical island and unicorns in the abstract style. That, I think, hits it out of the park. I don't know exactly if I'd be wanting to use this as a wallpaper, but hey, you can see how unique some of these options can be. Let's do one more, um, and let's do, let me see, let's do imagery, a surreal, actually, you know what, let's go with what it defaulted to, a surreal castle made of silk in shades of coral and tan, oh, actually, I hit the wrong button, it's going to go ahead and generate a surreal Pagonda made a felt in shades of yellow and teal. So, pretty good there. One final one. Mm, let's do textures. Abstract image of blue oil. Create. So you can see how quick some of these do get generated when it's not a ton of options listed. That's actually pretty neat right there. Definitely abstract and definitely looks pretty oily in a blue shade. 
So yeah, plenty of options, very, very easy to select, create, and obviously impact or influence you. So let's do butterflies, blue, create. If you want to actually apply it, it's just as simple. You're gonna select that uh, check mark on the top right of the screen. Let's go with this one right here. And that is showing you what it will look like if you want to apply it. You'll say select wallpaper, and of course, you're good to go. So yeah, pretty easy, not too much to it, but it could be a fun little uh, time waster if you want to decide on some new wallpapers, something more unique for your device and your device alone. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll catch you in the next one. Peace.